Hey boys and girls, this is Mrs. Vicaretti here, just calling and checking in with you guys. I know it's been quite a while since we've seen each other. I know that um, we are all stuck in our houses and kind of probably getting a little restless by this point. I just wanted to let you know that I'm thinking about you guys every day. Um, and I just wanted to hop on here and check in on you and say hi, say how you doing, and that I'm thinking of you. However, I also thought of a fun little game, you know, hopefully that we will be able to um, have you guys play at home with some of your family members that you guys are stuck in the house with. Um, or you can do it by yourself if you choose to. So what this is, is this is just a game that I like to fill in. Um, and you could do it kind of however you want. But today, um, my sign here is about our emotions because I know during this time, I'm sure we're all probably feeling the same emotions, me included. And I have two little ones too here that um, get kind of frustrated and mad and tired and bored and confused and you know we're kind of going through it all together so um, I come, came up with this game and I thought it was kind of fun uh, so I hope that maybe you can get an opportunity to play it with your family so all you really need is um, to follow the sign and then you're just gonna need to find a die which is um, like this okay so your die here um, you could probably find it in any of your board games um, and you just need one um, it, if you want to change it up a little to make it a little bit different um, you could do that as well it's very flexible so what we're gonna do here is um, each die has um, a number up to six one through six and the way that you know that is by counting the black dots see here I have a number one Okay, and then here I got a number three, and you have three little black dots, one, two, three. Okay, and then we got two, and six, and five, and we got a whole bunch of different ones, one through six, okay? So what you're gonna do now is you are just gonna roll the die, okay? All right, and I got a number three. So I find a number three here, and I say, and it says, I feel scared when, and then you talk about a time when you feel scared. So uh, one of the times that I feel scared is I feel scared when I'm not really too sure on what's going on, and I hear a lot of other people having conversations, and it makes me a little scared because scared comes from things that you don't really know or understand. So one, of the, but the one thing is it's okay to feel scared. It's okay to feel mad or sad. It's okay to be have these feelings. But we want to make sure that we don't get stuck in these feelings, okay? So one of the things is that we need to remember is that if I feel scared or you feel scared, that you figure out a way to make yourself get happy all over again, okay? How do you get yourself out of that scared situation and get yourself calm and happy, okay? And one of those, and that's how your strategies come in. So when I feel scared, a lot of times I go to and talk to somebody that I trust and talk to them about the things that I overheard or what makes me scared, and then we come up with an idea on how to fix that, okay? And that sometimes gets me from that scared to that calm zone, all right? So, and then what you can do is you can have a conversation with whoever you're playing with, and then we will um, have the next person go. So what they'll do is they'll take the dice, just like I did. They're going to roll it. And I got three again. And then here I got a uh, six, okay? C6, six, six dots. And then you're gonna go to number six. And it says, I feel happy when, and then you talk about a time when you feel happy, okay? I feel happy when the sun is out and it's really warm and I can go outside and I can kind of just do my own thing, okay? So I love when it's nice outside. So that makes me feel really, really happy, okay? And then you can have a conversation with whoever you're playing with about things that make you happy. Or if your answer is like mine and you like to, you feel happy when you're outside, Maybe you could talk about things that you like to do outside. What are your favorite activities, okay? And then the next person goes, okay? And you roll the die again, and I got a two. You go to the number two. I feel mad when, talk about a time when you feel mad. Because again, it's okay to feel mad. We don't want to stay being mad though. We don't want to be mad every day, all the time. So I feel mad when my children like to fight each other. Okay, so when they argue and they get on each other's nerves, it makes me frustrated. So sometimes what I need to do is I need to take a deep breath. 